watch the sun go down over the same old town like so many times before we look at the same old stars battle the same old wars like so many times before and i know that we're not perfect but i'm gonna miss all that we had yeah i know that we're not perfect but i need this night for the last time Afternoon guys, back out again. Today we've just got three small ones to pick up today, but after the last one where where, where I didn't get pitched up until midnight, I wanted to actually get set up nice and early, enjoy the camp a bit, so less walking. Still picking up three summits, but less walking, more camping. So we're doing South of Fell, Bannerdale Crag and bow scale fell they're all just uh, literally the other side northwest of Blancafra so the weather's not forecasted to be great strong winds heavy rain but the north northwesterly winds so I'm hoping that um, I'm hoping that Blancafra shouters me from, from the majority of it so that was me thinking we're picking these three so we'll have a look Okay, two choices here. We can either go right and up the nose, or we can go left and up the side and then double back onto the top. A bit longer, but you know what, we're in no rush. Nice steady one today. Easy route, my arse. You know what? I should have just gone straight up the nose, I think. A little bit steeper, but nowhere near as long. Doesn't look bad, maybe it's just me, but maybe it's just because I've just started, but I am absolutely blowing. We just got up up the side of Southern Fell. Not far to go now. Summit's just there. The wind is pretty strong. I'll see if I can get Dave out, but I don't think so, to be honest. But yeah, no, we'll see. There we go, guys. The top of Silver Fell, 522 meters. I'm the bad one, take a look at yourself In the mirror, if I'm the worst one Ask anybody else, who do you prefer? If it comes down to me and you, I think that you are the one with a bad attitude What sort of conflict you got no I thought I'd set our route now. We'll drop down off Southern Fell, up on the Bannerdale Crags, around, and then Bow Scale Fell in the distance is where we will uh, we'll set up camp. The wind is picking up. No external mic, but T in Valhalla kindly. Uh, prompted me to try one of these these gold post rounds first before spending a fortune on a on an external mic so their audio always sounds spot on so so yeah we'll see see how this comes out in the end a link a link to the channel will be in the description you should check them out i mean they're they're a proper channel not like mine You 
now see on my two other blank kaffir videos <laughs> in fact my first ever video on youtube i went straight up onto the ridge up to blank kaffir second time we come down and cut across the side here which takes you towards the tarn and then ready for um for sharp edge do you see in a minute as we come over here if we park at the white <laughs> fucking almost on about you'll see in a minute as we come over if you park at the white horse in at scales and you just come straight up um this way it brings you to i'll just drop down into the coal now see from the left that's where you come up when you uh, park at the white horse in down at scales and up there is your route to Blencaffer straight ahead we can go up and then to the right and follow that path takes you up to sharp edge and you look at sharp edge from here it's got to be one of the best looking ridges in the lakes by far is there such things as a best looking ridge maybe that's me but i'm sure some people will, will agree So first change of plan was going to go up onto the nose of Bannerdale Crags but I think if we walk down the side here and go in at the back side we should get some really good views of Sharp Edge you can just make out I don't know if you will be able to but you can see the gully just on the right as it starts going up and you've got one just to the left of it that's a bad step there you can see this flat bit just before it that's the big slate rock that becomes very slippery in the wet anyway I'll stop going on about sharp edge now let's get up this There's Southern Fell, where we, uh, where we was up before. We get a loop round up onto Bow Scale Fell. Pick up the pieces I'm turning things up 
right guys Summit of Bulk Scale Fell 702 metres Well, just got the tent set up and tried to tuck myself down out of the way of the wind Hopefully we're alright and get some tea on See you soon yeah, I can't I got you by my side A million reasons For me to see clear And you're in the middle Alright Turned out alright I've not cut into it yet <laughs> So we'll see how that goes but Yeah, there we go Steak, peppers and onions On the jet boil I'd like to thank Kerry and Kat From Tea in Valhalla for nominating me for the uh, old man's challenge there's absolutely no chance i'm going to be able to do this but let's give it a go I'm not tied up, no chance. Well, good morning, guys. Bit of a rough night last night with the wind. I mean, I, I slept pretty well, I think I only woke up a couple of times. I got up this morning, as you can see, the clag is well and truly in. You cannot see anything in any direction, so I've got my kit packed up, just a tent to go. This trip summit shout out is going to be to Vague Bond Turtle from Sweden. Um, give a channel a check out. There's a lot of walking tours and uh, stuff like that and, and she's not a she's not a million miles away from the 1k so if we could help her get a few more subscribers that would be great and while we're at it turtle i would like to nominate you to do the uh, old man challenge i've attempted it and failed it so i'll pass it on to you now <laughs> it's time for me to get off the top of this freaking hill <laughs> 